The Spurs opening the unofficial second half of their season at Conseco against the Pacers team that they've beaten five straight times. Tony Parker back on the floor after missing a game with a hip injury. His presence figured to bolster the Spurs' chances on Wednesday. And TP had it working from the start. He had a pad on that injured hip. He received treatment during the game. They got a little sore on him, but he was all right. As you see him dish it to Richard Jefferson, who throws it down. Later in the second, TP failing it. 28 points on the night for him. Still in the quarter. Danny Granger on the other end. Crossover. Takes the contact off the glass. It's going to go. 46-39 ball game at that point. Meanwhile, Monte Ginobili with the steal and the jam. Providing an offensive spark for the Spurs. Ginobili off the feed from Duncan. Another jam. 12-point lead for the Spurs. And it's Timmy eh? knocking a shot down. This was not common in the game for TD. He kind of celebrates here because he was 4 of 23 from the field. Did have 26 rebounds, though, with five assists. So I guess he got made up for it. Eight-point ball game. Pacers won't go away. Mike Dunleavy knocks down the three. Five-point ball game in the fourth now. Brandon Rush behind the line. He's going to knock it down. We got ourselves a tie ball game at 82 apiece. Ensuing possession for the Spurs. RJ right back at you. He had 13 points. Spurs starting to heat up. Manu makes his way to the bucket. Gets it to go with the foul. He makes the free throw. 18 points, 7 assists, and 6 rebounds. On the other end, though, it's Danny Granger stroking the 3. 23 points. It's a 3-point game under 10 to go. Indiana chooses not to foul. Spurs able to run the clock out. Hustling on the offensive boards. And that's all she wrote. It was close, but it was a game that the Spurs would win. 90-87 to 87 the final, led by TP's 28.